Welcome to my channel. Good morning, guys. Today is the start of the construction. Um, we are adding two rooms at the back. So let's check. It's locked. <laughs> These are the materials needed guys, different sizes of steel bars, you can inquire it in the hardware store. We need wood, cement, so we will be using some roof sheets, and this one guys, tire wire, so they do it like that for tying the steel bars. Then tire wires and these are the carpenter's tools they used okay. so they are going to construct a comfort room guys and additional two bedrooms in this area okay before the restrooms are there the two restrooms that's for boys so we will be constructing for girls here project guys is a contract for 80,000 pesos labor so so in today's vlog guys I'm gonna share to you how to construct a building in a sloping area near the water to show you guys how they do it so it will be safe in the future so first what they need to do guys is they dig a hole as big as that for the post it needs to be done like that guys so that the building will not sink so later you will see guys how they do it That's how they cut the steel bars. And Manong is gonna make this. This will be used for the post again. Yeah. 
Timo ring. Uh, so they call it a ring, guys, for the food. This is the first day of their work, guys. And every day I will be recording it. So, yeah, literally, to see the progress of each carpenter. For the big post, guys, they use steel bar size 16, uh, 4 size 16 steel bars, and 4 size 14. On size standard spacing, Anna, kuya, pila ka inches. Ang iyahang spacing on size standard. Oo, oh, oh, kaladyo. Good morning again, guys. This is second day. <laughs> That's a carabao, guys. Well, this is the second day guys and they are removing the old post that was constructed before and that's how deep they need to be guys in order to put a very solid post right, this is the kind of Gravel that we need. We need the big one for the backfill and this one for the next chair. Uh, we've got some plywood also, guys, that we need.
this is what they have finished in day two guys good morning guys welcome to day three Ratio anak ko yan is kuan. Ang say ratio anak ko yan. 1 to 3. So, 1 cement, 2 sands, and 3 gravel. So, the mixture of this one, guys, is 1 cement, 1 sack of cement, 2 sacks of sands, and 3 sacks of gravels. This is for the filling of the post, of the basic post. We are near water guys, so the water is free now in construction. <laughs>
Big stones in the hole, guys. I will not. It will be so solid. Big stones. So, linalagyan na yun. They, they are putting a cement on the pumps now, guys. And, um, from time to time. This is day five. So welcome to day six, guys. They've done already the six posts. Now they're about to make four. And they are digging for the comfort room. There. So this is the hole for the comfort room. They said the guys and they're about to make the floor. Morning guys. It was raining last night. Look at that. So now they're setting up for the floor guys. Some steel bars on the base of the wall. Soon. This is day eight, guys, and now they're setting up the for the wall, the base for the wall. And as you notice, guys, and like other contractors, the foundation is very solid. It has many, you know, many steels. Unlike other commercial buildings or housing loans. Guys, every day I will be taking this so all of us will get to know exactly how to do manually. So they are the um, traditional carpenters in our area, guys. So they can't afford such uh, expensive equipment to make it easier, but they make it possible by their hands on work. So, hope you enjoy watching guys. See you. See you every day. Bye.